Welcome back, guys. I'm here. I'm here to save the day, guys. <laughs> I really did you guys' reading yesterday, but I deleted it. I don't know. I just wasn't feeling feeling the energy. So we're going to try again tonight. All right, so come on in, guys. Hit the like button on the way in. Like, 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 like. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit subscribe. Yes, subscribe to the channel. You don't want to miss out, all right? So these are general reads. So they may or may not apply, okay? Don't try to fit it if it does not fit, okay? It is a general read. If you want to book your very own personal reading, that information is going to be in the drop box below. I'll leave my email for you to contact me to book your very own reading, okay? So let's get into it. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, okay? So let's see what message. What's, what message do you have for Aquarius for June? June. It's mid-month. Going into the end, guys, we are actually... Mercury is going retrograde, going retrograde. So a lot of things may be coming to re, you know, coming back up to the surface. Things that haven't been closed, cycles that haven't been closed, exes may be trying to creep back in situations. It's not a good time to, you know, sign new documents and things like that. Like we got to be on our P's and Q's when we're dealing with this Mercury retrograde. All right, so let's see what what energy we got coming towards you guys. Let's see. What messages do you have for my Aquarius? Give me a free for Aquarius, please. I got the Knight of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles. Capricorn's energy. You could be dealing with the Capricorn, but things may be going slow. You may be trying to take your time and being strategic. Okay, the Knight of Pentacles is very analytic. Like, they analyze everything before they make it move. They're not jumping to conclusions quick at all. They're going to take their slow-ass time to make a decision, to make a move. So, things have, you may have decided to be, to analyze. You may be analyzing things. This could also be a small offer, okay, some type of offer. But I feel like if it is an offer, it's a small offer, Okay. Okay, we got the page of wands, okay? Yeah, this is action, communication. Or I'm getting somebody finally decided to speak or say something to you or tell you something. Because I got the judgment in the Wheel of Fortune. So... This is like a aha moment. This is like finally the big moment, okay? A big change, okay? Let's see. Aquarius. Okay. This one to flip over. Okay, the nine of wands. Yeah. Maybe somebody's been hiding something. Five of Swords, okay? Mmm. Hermit and the Six of Cups. Okay, what is this? Okay, and the Fool. Okay. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Oh, the Nine of Swords. So, you're a little worried about something. You're a little worried. Okay, so you just got some shocking news with the Tower and the Knight of Wands here. You just could have got some shocking news that's kind of got you, like, worried a little bit. Why is the Page of Wands? Okay, the world. So, telling everybody this secret. Yeah, there's a, some type of secret. There's something that's hidden here that was hidden. Why is the Nine of Wands here? I feel like somebody's hiding something. Why is the Nine of Wands? Like somebody's avoiding you or you've been hiding from somebody. You're avoiding somebody or somebody is avoiding you. Why is the Nine of Wands here? Yeah. <laughs> something about watching how you move. 
okay? You may be feeling a little worried. You feel like you got to watch how you move, okay? Why is the Five of Swords here? You may feel like somebody is jealous of somebody or there's some type of conflict. Why is the Five of Swords here? Okay, hangman. Okay, you're waiting to see if somebody's going to fail or <laughs> waiting to see if somebody's going to get mad. What is this? Hangman. Why is the hangman here? The nine of cups. Okay, so you want somebody to say something. You want... <laughs> you want somebody to press your button. Hmm. I want the hermit here. The four of wands. Somebody's been being distant. You've been hiding from somebody, or somebody's hiding from you. And somebody's not taking any action. But I see full force, full force going ahead. Yeah, like somebody's going on a new adventure. You're going on a new adventure. Like something that I feel like you've been like dodging somebody. You're dodging somebody or dodging something. But you're going full fledged. You're trying something new going ahead. You're going to try something new. You're trying something new. New. Why is Ace Cups here? Maybe you're trying a new approach. Why is the Ace of Cups here? Yeah. The Justice card and the Ten of Pentacles. I'm getting like you guys are trying a new approach. We got the Page of Wands. And yeah, someone could be pregnant here. Look at this mom and dad. Okay. We got the dad card here. We got the dad card here, so maybe you're not sure if someone is pregnant, okay? Because look, I got the Empress here and the Ace of Wands, definitely very much so pregnant energy. Someone could find out that somebody is pregnant. And I got the Page of Pentacles where someone is telling someone's mother or father something. Um, someone here needs to also balance out their money. We got the Justice and the Ten of Pentacles. The Queen of Swords, yeah. You guys is energy. So maybe you're trying something new. So now you're trying to, it may involve family. It may involve a marriage. It may involve balancing out your finances. But you're, you're kind of worried about something right now. Making somebody wait. <laughs> or somebody made you wait. Wait to tell something. Somebody made somebody wait to tell somebody something. That's what I'm getting. So there's a secret. Okay. Ooh. Somebody was listening to other people too or heard about it. Somebody heard about something. You heard about this. But maybe you was waiting on this person to tell you. Is what I'm getting as well too. But you're you I'm getting with the full card and the ace of cups. You're trying something new. Okay, you're gonna be trying something new. Why is the Queen of Swords here? The Ten of Cups. Okay. You're going to be happy you did. So, did y'all hear something from the streets? Or well, y'all heard a little birdie told y'all something you was waiting on somebody to come tell you, but... You know, waiting for them to come tell you. 
or vice versa is what I'm getting. What message do you have for Aquarius? Ooh, okay, all right. All right. Okay, break the chain and unbound. Ooh, a lot of releasing old patterns, okay? A lot of releasing. You guys are releasing something or someone. Like you're letting go of a, a, a old way of thinking, a old way of doing things. You're letting go. And I feel like you guys are breaking free of something and trying something new with that full card being in the future energy and that ace of cups. This is definitely like taking a leap of faith and trying new things. All right. So good for you, Aquarius. Good for you. Most death. So if this reading resonated, guys, hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. As well as if you would like to book your own personal reading, that information is in the drop box below. All right, chat with y'all later.